up? This is B-Boy of Insanity and today we're going to learn swipes. Alright, so I'm going to try to make this as simple as possible and work our way from the ground up. We're going to start off using two feet, just like this, and we're either going to be facing the front, side, back, or the other side. If you're left-handed, you're going to swing your left hand to the side. If you're right-handed, you swing your right hand to the side. I use my left hand, but I'm right-handed, so I'm a little bit goofy. But you're going to start off putting your left hand down, and your legs are going to jump this way and basically unwind. So your hand goes down, feet jump, and land. You swing your arms to the other side, arms go down, legs jump. Arms swing around, arms down, jump, and one more time, arms, feet. All right, so when you land, you actually want to land on the baller feet, which is basically on your toes. So it kind of gets that springing motion. So this time when we do it, we're actually going to make it a little bit harder. All right, so now when we put our hand down, we're not just going to swing our legs up, but we're actually going to attempt to go into a handstand. We're not actually going to go into a handstand, but it's going to kind of look like you're trying to go into a handstand. So when you put your hands down, you're going to kind of put your, your weight on your arms and jump and land. So when you swing your arm around, again, hands go down, kind of jump into a handstand. Again, handstand down. Again, handstand down. All right? So that's what gives you your lift. Next, what we want to do is we want to keep our hips up. So doing swipes like this look kind of beginner. So what we want to do is keep our hips up. So we're going to try to hold our hips like this the whole time. So swing over, land. Arm swing over, land. Swing over, land. Swing over, land. All right, and that's the basics. All right, so now we're gonna take it to the next level. If you are right-handed, you're gonna step back with your right foot. If you're left-handed, you step back with your left foot. This also means that you should be doing your pilot pose on your left hand. Some people like me, I'm right-handed, but I step back with my left foot, I pilot pose on my left hand. Um, it's a little bit different, but you step back. You're gonna put your opposite hand. So if you're left-handed, you put your right hand down. If you're right-handed, you put your left hand down. You put your hand down and you kick your left foot up you're gonna switch legs like this and then step down. Let's try it one more time. So you step back, kick, switch. All right, and from there is when we're gonna start our swipe. So we go step back, kick, switch, turn, swipe. Now we're gonna do it from standing. We're gonna step back and go here. Ready? One, two, three. All right, so now we're gonna do it on just one leg. The only difference between two legs and one leg is that you're on one leg, right? So when you put your leg out, you're gonna jump over that leg. So again, if you're left-handed, this should be your right leg. If you're right-handed, this should be your left leg, and so on. So put your leg out and you reach over, you basically jump over that leg. So you go here, jump, and land. Trying to keep that leg straight. So ready, jump over, land, okay? So now we're ready for the real thing. All right, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. All right, so that is the swipe. Make sure you guys practice that a lot because this is a difficult move and does take a lot of hard work and dedication. I'll leave you guys with that. Have fun. Peace.